three, two, one. Hey, we're Tanner's family, and we bring the fight. We're the parents of Kyle Aerosmith. We are the parents of Bronson Rickstone. This is the Bosso's family for BJ. We're the parents of Daniel David. We're the parents of TJ Reed. I'm here on behalf of my son, Nabonchi Larry. We represent Dorian Walker, number one. We're the Ficklin family. We're the family of Andrew Butcher. Our first um, interaction was with Coach Worley and Co Coach Chestnut, and they were amazing. They pursued Kyle um, many, many lunches and get-togethers with him, and they finally convinced us to come for a visit, and it was amazing. Kennesaw State seemed like a great option. It was close to home and uh, up-and-coming program and obviously a winning program, and uh, we came to visit, and uh, we were sold. From the time he stepped foot on Kennesaw State's campus till now, he has really developed as a human being, as a man. His maturity level is just risen a lot since he left home. His work ethic. He works so hard 24-7. He, he eats, sleeps, and breathes whatever he's doing. And I've just seen him progress as a player, just watching him even before college. I think you start at nine years old and you watch these boys out there on the field, just what they've learned to do. Last year, he caught a a pass and was going up the sideline and you thought he was going to go out of bounds or get tackled and he spins, breaks those tackles and takes off. I think it was his first touchdown and it was like, oh, there, there he goes. <laughs> there he starts. Yeah, he laid that wood on that man. Oh, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> it was about a couple of weeks ago, a couple of three weeks ago, and it was a kickoff return and he came down and just Perry, the returner. Water boy. It was pretty ridiculous. When he didn't do well, I would say, oh, then you're not playing football the next game. And the next time, BJ will bring me all A's and B's. And so I have seen him from his lowest to his highest point, which is now. It's just, it just important. I, I mean, it's just unexplainable to me and my wife to see him grow up as a man and earn this, this degree. Uh, I just want to say, uh, Hold on. <laughs> I think the best thing is for me to see you mature as a young man. I'm proud of you, son, and I do love you. I'm so proud of the young man you have become, and congratulations, and I love you. I'm just ready and excited to see the next chapter in his life. We love you, and we ask for God's blessings upon you as you move forward. Take the lessons that you've learned from football, apply them to your life, and we know you'll be successful. Life is more than just um, today's wins and losses. It's about developing into a leader. It's about it's about influence, positively influencing people. And uh, I could not be more proud of the man you've become. Overall, I'm really proud of being Levante's dad. You're going to do great things. Uh, keep striving to improve, and we love you. We got your back, and the best is yet to come. Very, very proud of the man to become. Hey, mommy. We love you, and God bless you.